In this video, you will witness the strangest and strangest thefts that people have ever experienced. You won't be able to hide your surprise when you hear what kind of people's belongings have been stolen. Wondering why these thieves steal such strange things? Then watch this video and see for yourself. Here are the 10 weirdest things stolen from people. Number 10. A piece of art. In 2018, a piece of art was stolen from a museum in Paris. The painting was worth $10 million and was never recovered. The theft occurred overnight and the thieves were able to get away with the painting without being seen. The museum has offered a reward for the return of the painting, but so far no one has come forward. The painting that was stolen is a work by the artist Banksy. It is a stencil of a masked rat holding a knife. The rat is painted on the back of a traffic sign in Paris' 4th arrondissement. Banksy is a famous street artist who is known for his graffiti-style artwork. He often uses his art to make political or social commentary. The theft of the Banksy painting is a major loss for the museum and for the city of Paris. The painting was a popular tourist attraction, and its theft has damaged the city's reputation as a cultural center. The police are still investigating the theft, but so far no arrests have been made. Number 9. A Manhole Cover In 2017, a cast iron manhole cover weighing 500 pounds was stolen from a street in New York City. The theft was never solved, and the cover was never recovered. The manhole cover was located in a busy intersection, and its removal caused traffic to back up for miles. The open manhole was also a safety hazard, as it was a potential tripping hazard for pedestrians and cyclists. The theft of the manhole cover sparked a citywide manhunt, but police were unable to find the missing cover. The city also offered a reward for information leading to the recovery of the cover, but no one came forward. The theft of the manhole cover remains a mystery to this day. Some people believe that it was stolen for scrap metal, while others believe that it was stolen for a more nefarious purpose. Whatever the reason, the theft of the manhole cover is a reminder that even in a big city, there are still some things that are beyond our control. Number 8. A Human Toe In 2013, a man in Florida had his toe stolen while he was sleeping. The thief, who was never caught, apparently cut off the man's toe with a pair of scissors. The man woke up to find his toe missing and blood on his pillow. He called the police, but they were unable to find any leads. The man was left with a permanent reminder of the crime, a scar on his foot where his toe used to be. The crime remains unsolved, and the motive for the toe theft is unknown. Some people have speculated that the thief was a medical student who was practicing surgery, while others have suggested that the theft was motivated by a fetish. Whatever the reason, the crime is a reminder of the strange and sometimes violent things that can happen in Florida. Number 7. A Pet Pig In 2015, a pet pig named Wilbur was stolen from a farm in New Jersey. Wilbur was worth $1,000 and was never recovered. Wilbur was a 200-pound pot-bellied pig who was loved by his owners, the Smith family. He was a gentle giant who loved to play fetch and cuddle. The Smiths were devastated when Wilbur was stolen. They offered a $1,000 reward for his return, but no one came forward. The police believe that Wilbur was stolen by someone who knew about him and wanted to sell him. They say that it is possible that Wilbur was taken to another state or even to another country. The Smiths are still holding out hope that Wilbur will be returned. They say that he is a part of their family, and they miss him dearly. Number 6. A Giant Inflatable Gorilla In 2010, a giant inflatable gorilla was stolen from a car dealership in California. The gorilla was 350 pounds and 30 feet tall. It was never recovered. The gorilla was used as a marketing tool by the car dealership. It was often seen waving to passersby and was a popular attraction for children. The theft of the gorilla was a major blow to the dealership, and they offered a $10,000 reward for its return. The police investigated the theft, but they were unable to find any leads. The gorilla remains missing to this day, and the mystery of its disappearance remains unsolved. Some people believe that the gorilla was stolen by pranksters, while others believe that it was stolen for its scrap value. Whatever the reason, the theft of the giant inflatable gorilla is a reminder that even the most unusual things can be stolen. Number 5. A Bridge In 2016, a group of thieves stole a 100-foot-long bridge from a small town in the Czech Republic. The bridge was reportedly dismantled and sold for scrap metal. The bridge was located in the town of Klumek nad Sidlinu and was used to cross a small river. 
It was made of steel and concrete and weighed several tons. The thieves reportedly used a crane to lift the bridge and then transported it to a nearby scrapyard. The theft of the bridge caused a major disruption to the town. The bridge was the only way to cross the river and its removal left the town cut in two. The town council was forced to build a temporary bridge to allow people to get around. The police investigated the theft, but they were unable to find the thieves. The bridge has never been recovered. The theft of the bridge is a reminder that even large and heavy objects can be stolen. It is also a reminder that scrap metal can be a valuable commodity. Number 4. A Glacier In 2014, a group of thieves stole a 10-ton glacier from a Swiss mountain. The glacier was reportedly cut into pieces and sold for scrap metal. The thieves, who have not been identified, are believed to have used a helicopter to access the glacier and then used a saw to cut it into pieces. The pieces were then loaded onto a truck and taken away. The theft of the glacier has caused outrage in Switzerland. The government has vowed to find the thieves and bring them to justice. The theft of the glacier is a reminder of the vulnerability of these natural wonders. As the climate changes, glaciers are melting at an alarming rate. This theft is a sign of things to come, as glaciers become increasingly valuable commodities. Number 3. Napoleon's Penis The fate of Napoleon's penis is a bizarre tale of history and mystery. After the French emperor died on the island of St. Helena in 1821, his doctor cut off his penis during the autopsy and gave it to a priest, who smuggled it to Corsica. The penis changed hands several times over the years, until it was bought by a urologist and collector named John K. Latimer in 1977. He kept it under his bed in a briefcase until his death in 2007. The penis has been described as a piece of leather or a shriveled eel by those who have seen it. It was measured at only 1.5 inches long by a documentary that aired on Channel 4 in 2014. The French government has never acknowledged its existence or tried to reclaim it. The penis's current owner is Latimer's daughter, who has been offered at least $100,000 for it. She has not revealed whether she plans to sell it or keep it as a family heirloom. Number 2. Charlie Chaplin's Grave World-famous actor and director Charlie Chaplin's tomb was stolen for ransom shortly after his death in December 1977. His wife, Una, refused to pay the ransomers the $600,000 they demanded. The police continued their search operations and tapped Una's phones and closely monitored 200 telephone booths in the area. After a five-week investigation, the police arrested two auto mechanics Roman Wardas of Poland and Gansko Ganov of Bulgaria who led them to Chaplin's body, which they had buried in a cornfield about one mile from the Chaplin family's home in Corsier. Wardas and Ganov were convicted of grave robbing and attempted extortion. They were sentenced to four and a half years and three years in prison, respectively. Chaplin's body was reburied in the same cemetery, and his family later had a new headstone installed with a security system to prevent future thefts. Number 1. Einstein's Brain After Albert Einstein died in 1955, his brain was removed without his family's consent and taken to a New York hospital. There, it was sliced into 240 pieces and studied by a team of scientists. The scientists were hoping to find clues to Einstein's genius, but they were ultimately unsuccessful. The brain was eventually lost, and its whereabouts remain unknown to this day. The removal of Einstein's brain without his family's consent was controversial at the time. Some people felt that it was disrespectful to Einstein's memory, while others felt that it was a necessary scientific experiment. The fact that the brain was eventually lost only added to the controversy. Despite the controversy, the story of Einstein's brain is a fascinating one. It is a reminder of the power of science and the importance of understanding the human brain. It is also a reminder that even the greatest minds are not immune to the whims of fate. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell. Follow us for more videos.